welcome back guys in this video we are going to learn java program uh, one of the interview question actually write a java program to generate output is this one this is a string and input should be the string string of a2 b3 and c1 right so now this is actually string i can create a string and create one variable uh, this is the string over here i need to create We'll understand how we are going to design the script. Here, first we need to get the length of the string. As per the length, we need to iterate. So we can use for loop over here. So for loop should be uh, int i equal to zero i less than. We need to get the length of str dot length, then i plus plus. So I'm just iterating. Going to take one by one character. Right within the for loop, so we need to add a condition over here. In the condition, it is going to check each character is alphabetic or numeric, right? Because it's going to take one by one character and it is going to check whether it is a numeric character or it is an alphabetic character. So I can add a condition if character dot is alphabetic, str dot character at. So this is going to return a first one character. So if the condition is true means here what we need to do if it is alpha character then need to print the character so i can print str dot character at i so this is going to print the condition is true it is going to print if the condition is false right if the condition is false means here it is alpha then it is numeric only right so this is the condition is true it is alpha otherwise it is going to be numeric only So I am just going to create an uh, one variable for a uh, storing that numeric value. I can say character dot get dot get numeric value str dot character at. So I am just going to store the value over here. Right as per the numeric value, we can add a one more for loop. This loop will iterate as per the number. Suppose here, here x means first character will be first number will be two. Right? If it is a two, it's going to iterate two times. If it is a three, it has to the loop has to iterate three times. Right? Now first time it is going to take a two only, so it will going to iterate two times. So I can add a for loop. Why two times? We need to print actually output should be this one two times. It has to print a y. Already one y already printed. So what happened? We have to start a for loop uh, instead of zero. We need to start from one. Int j equal to one because already printed one. Right? So we need to print only one more time. So I can say j less than x. Here, uh, j plus plus. Right? So now this is one more loop. Here, what we need to do? We need to print the Str dot character at we need to pass that here what we need to print it should not be i directly it should be i minus one why because now the value is you know two only i minus one means this is the a so a again one time how many times it has to iterate the the so that many time it has to print the a if it is a b Here already it is it should come three right so three times the loop has to iterate already we are starting from one so what happened already one is there so again two time it will go into iterate and again two b will go into print so here already one b is there and one more one two more b also will go into print right so now this is what uh, the thing is now I'll run this I'll show you the output uh, how this is coming over here. C A A B B B C. Now I don't want to print in this way vertically. I want to print this in a in horizontal way. I mean one single line. I I just wanted to print. So what I can do? I don't. I'm just removing this. Uh, yeah, line, new line. I don't want the new line. So I'm just removing this. So it is printing in this way. Right. Recently, many companies are asking this Java question. Next video, I am going to share you write a Java program. So, what I'll do? Input should be um, this one. Output should be 
now in this program right so we have given an input is this output is this the next recording next video what i am going to share this should be input so if i am giving an input is this output should be coming in this way this should be output right so we'll see how this is uh, we we'll can uh, do that right so we can achieve that in different way we'll understand and learn in next video i hope this is going to be helpful thank you